Hello everybody, it's Joe here, and welcome back to Transport Fever 2, the Piddlemouth Coast series. Today you find us sat, uh, well, we're, we're just where we left off. Oh look, there's a grain train going past. Completely not planned. Just, hey, nice surprise. Um, yeah, we're sat here at Piddlemouth South. We're with our little Class 20, and we're nearly full. A little bit disappointed to see that all of them are evergreen, uh, evergreen containers. Um, there's possibly a section in the menu where you can customise that, and maybe I've just not done it correctly. But uh, yeah, nearly fully loaded, so I thought we would join it on its inaugural trip. I've forgotten to uh, to unpause the date. There, there we go. We'll, we'll, we'll unpause the date. I'm an absolute bugger for forgetting to unpause the date. You know, I really am. Uh, so yeah, all is pretty hunky dory. Money is going up, 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 which is what we like. We'll just repay a bit more of that loan now. I mean, look at that. We've been low thirty million. It's you know things are going good, things are going really good. Oh, and away we go. So we are off to North Killtown Machines Train. No, we're not. That's the name of the route. North Killtown Branch. And listen to the sounds on that. That sounds absolutely fantastic, doesn't it? I love the sound of the twenty. I really do. You know what? I'm I'm really enjoying Transport Fever. I'm I'm sure that you're probably like, well, obviously, otherwise you wouldn't be playing it, would you? But no, I genuinely am enjoying Transport Fever. I've I've had a while away from it, um, but it's it's really good to get back into it. It is just like having your own little model railway, isn't it? Except you need to make money, and if you don't, it, you go bankrupt. I mean, just look at that with that train as well. It's you know things are good. That's, uh, yeah, that's that's not deserving of a screenshot because we're too far away now. But that would have made a really good screenshot if I'd have, you know, if I'd have thought to do so. So, of course, this is powering up onto the Piddlemouth branch, uh, which we're just going to join now in a, uh, in a wiggly ladder style of junction. There we go. We're in. Beautiful, beautiful. And, uh, of course, we're going to go across our funky bridge. There's not really any need at all, is there, for, uh, for, for us to go in to come out. We could, if I was feeling particularly rambunctious, uh, we could just pop a bit of track so that it doesn't need to join this line. We could. Let's, let's, uh, let's, in fact, yeah, let's, I don't want to miss, I don't want to miss a thing. You're gonna go all Aerosmith on uh, on the situation, but I think if we do, because uh, at the moment it comes back in to go straight back out, doesn't it? Uh, I reckon if we build a bit of track there, bit of sixty. I mean, you're never gonna be at sixty at this point, are you? But if we if we just slap that across there, bit of bit of three track. We'll have a signal as well, because obviously we need a signal, because uh, the the other freight lines use that. There we go. Ooh, lovely. Pop a signal there. We don't need a signal there, but we'll pop one there anyway. Has it, has it like, defaulted? Oh, yes, it did as well. That's nice. I mean, it still comes across like that. But, uh, you know, it's fine. It's, uh, you know, it's one less train off the tracks. Ooh, this, this is one of my favourite bits. I, I don't like the, the kind of the down before the bridge, before the viaduct. But if we didn't, it wouldn't work. So, uh, you know, we, we have to make these sacrifices. We've got a hundred tools on board, which are, of course, going to go to the hub. And uh, that's going to be transported into North Killtown. I, uh, I'm, I'm playing with, like, the mod packs that this map suggests. So I've never played where, as the towns get bigger, they get more industries. I've never played the game like that before, but I'm, I'm quite enjoying it. Oh, let's, uh, let's see if we can get some sort of... Some, some juicy... Some juicy shot with the mountains in the background. That that would be nice, wouldn't it? That's uh, that's that's oh bloody auto save. The auto save is having no effect on what we're doing here at all. Um, what about what about that? That's nice. No, oh you've ruined everything. Curse you, eggs ed, egg scrolling, edge scrolling, and all that you stand for. Right, that's nice, pretty. Right, move on. I can't because the screenshot button's in the corner. There we go. The screenshot saved is blocking everything. Coming straight round now. Oh, look at that. Bit of flange as well going around the corner. I mean, it's only a short little shuttle train, isn't it? But it doesn't really go that far. 
it's, it's doing a decent speed, isn't it, really? I mean, how fast are we going here? About 60? 51? Yeah, it's, it's doing a, you know, alongside the main road there, it's getting up to a nice, decent bit of speed. I feel like we really should change that road so it's not a dirt road anymore. But then people will do that instead of taking the train, and we, we don't like that. We want them to take the train. Although the trains are absolutely packed. Oh, look at that, flying around the corner. I'm just wondering how much money we're going to make off this thing, because, uh, you know, obviously the, the kind of more manufactured your goods, the more you make off them. Well, that seems to be my kind of what I've observed. Oop, there's, a, there's the grain train that overtook us earlier. So uh, it's coming back empty. It's made us a, a small fortune there. Pay some loan. Yes, that's it. We pay some loan. Oh, look at that. We're, we're nearly 14 million. Down from 100 million. Oh, we can do this, look. Slowing down for the uh, for the corner there into, into the facilities. Oh, and another grain train. I'm so sorry. I hadn't realised you were both here. So, of course, we, we want this to eventually be really busy, don't we, with, uh, you know, taking goods to cities, etc, etc. Uh, that truck's looking a bit worse for wear, isn't it? Let's have a look. We'll see. Uh, hopefully, d Little Astreeth, you don't want you don't want tools, so it's all going to North Killtown delivery trucks. Two and a half million. That's uh, not as much as I thought, actually. Okay, we need to get more trucks on, on this situation. Uh, the delivery trucks, we need more of you. There we go. Three more. There's the depot. We're, uh, we're losing. We're losing valuable tools. You can only carry 17. Five more, then. Make more. More trucks. There we go. So we'll have, we'll have ten vehicles on there now. Oh look, all of the um Oh no, okay. But but look that that was going. That's sad. Oh no, hang on, you picked up seventeen. Right, that that's acceptable. I thought that literally we'd lost half of our goods in that zone. Well uh come on, there we go. New lorries, get picking up. There we go, 30. Ah, there we go. They're, they're picking up now. That's that's jolly good stuff. Jolly good stuff. Splendid. Right, okay. It's good. Where's the... Uh, are, are you there? Oh, no, you're, you're down here. There's a lot of things... Oh, no, hang on. We've, we've lost the train. There it is. Waiting for the express passenger. Good on you, son. Right, okay. Uh, so, yeah, that's uh, that's essentially that. We're going to borrow a ton of money now, uh, because we're going to do more things in this episode, of course. Um, now, passengers, in terms of passengers, um, I've, I've kind of expanded as much as I want to for the moment. Because uh, we're down at Penn still by Sea, you know, we've we've not got the name still pending, name Cod or Market Norwald. But, um, but yeah, at the moment, there's quite a lot of freight and industry around here, which I want to, you know, I want to get things going on with. You know, we've expanded main lines out by passenger. That's how I like to do it, work the freight around the passenger stuff. Because uh, I, I find that that's kind of how it's done in real life, would you say? Um, now, this is single track. This is going to need to be double track for what I want to do. Uh, because, as you can see, North Killtown, which seems to be our hub city, to be honest with you, wants fuel. Yes! How do we get fuel there, I hear you cry? Well, there is not an industry there. Uh, there is an industry down here by Puddle Bridge. Uh, the oil refinery and the fuel refinery. Both conveniently next to each other. Hmm. Will they speak to each other, you know, so that I don't actually have to transport there to there? I don't know. But we shall give it a go. So, um, uh, you see, this is a bit of a problem because I've not left myself with this line particularly large amount of space. So I don't know if this will be feasible, but uh, but we'll give it a go. Uh, right, no catenary. I don't want catenary. Don't want it. Don't like it. Nope. This map is purely and simply 
not about the catenary. Um, right, okay. We could truck you there. I don't want to truck you there. Um, I don't know how I'm going to train you there, though, to be honest with you. Um, right, okay. There. Well, that looks awful. Right, okay. Uh, Mr. Smoothing Gun is going to have to come out. Brush size and strength is smooth. Well, that looks marginally less horrific. There we go. Get a bit, a bit of that there as well. That looks almost... Well, it looks awful, doesn't it, really? But it, it looks less terrible than... Uh, I don't know, maybe I, I could perhaps buy that. Uh, we've not got high-speed tracks, so it doesn't match. Ooh. Things. Regional railways, map 4 coaches, West Midlands, PC Midline. Don't know what that is. Northern Spirit. Ooh. That's, that's a bit pretty, isn't it? Well, that's... Uh, you see, I keep saying this every every episode. I'm like, ooh, yeah, we're going to put some of those DMUs in. And then never do. There we go. Right. Uh, so, 30. Oh, hello, Mr. DMU. Right, so we're gonna, yeah, we'll, we'll cross you over. There we go. And we just need to, to, uh, should, should we, bit of 50. 50 is what we've stuck with so far, isn't it? What do you, what do you think about that? Um, What about that? Okay. You you've not kind of not given me any kind of hint. There we go. We'll we'll bring you across there. That that could work. I mean it's there's it's not thrown up any sort of horrific bumps and lumps so uh, so yeah we, we're rather using the word horrific in this I find it's it's a word frequently used to describe a lot of the things I build on this game uh, there we go right bung you in there um, there and there pop a bit of you there how do you think yes lovely uh, we'll, we'll have a signal in the middle we've we've kind of neglected this bit of line Purely and simply because it's only got the one passenger service running up and down it. Uh, we've we've resignalled a lot of this line, but obviously that's not going to cut the mustard anymore, is it? There we go. Right, let's uh, let's fly over here because as you can see, the uh, the nearest oil accumulation place, which I believe are called oil wells, oil wells. Yes, hello to you, uh, is here. I think. I mean that's that's the one I'm kind of aiming for. Yes. Yes, it is. Yes. There's one down there as well. That might be useful to uh, to pay a little visit later on. Um, but yeah, this is the nearest one. So, um, track construction building. Let's... Uh, I think just one track will suffice, won't it, as, uh, as always there. Can we... Lovely. Uh, but we'll, we'll have some high speed. I don't think we quite have the, uh, the need for third rail. Uh, ooh, I don't know what... I'd quite like you to be like to be like that, but the road's not correct for what I what I want to do with you. I could just shove you there. No, we'll we'll pop you alongside here. This road's going to have to skedaddle, uh, but we'll there you go. That's a tip. If you want to delete a little bit, build a junction. Ah, Joe, top tip for you. I'm sure most of you already knew that. To be fair. Um, you know, I only discovered it fairly recently. There. Now, doesn't that look like it was almost meant to be? Of course it does. How dare you suggest otherwise. Right, 50 miles an hour. Flat. Nope, oh, autosave. Curse you, autosave. Right, okay. Um, we'll have 30 mile an hour coming into the station. I'm going to dual track it, because do you know what? It, it may as well. It's not like we're short for cash now, is it? We're, we're not trying to do things on the cheap anymore. I mean, I'm, well, to be fair, I'm always trying to do things on the cheap. But, you know, we, we can cope with, uh, with, with having... Th 
things. Uh, right, now we, we'll do this section of track first. So we're, we're plodding along at 50, and you need to come off there. I said you need to come off there. That's the, uh, there. What do you look like there? You look fine to me. Fine. There's this kind of gap in the track, but it's fine. It's all fine. Bring you straight across there. What do you look like? Fine. Weirdly fine. Weirdly fine. Um, we'll bring you straight up and over there. Again, doesn't look too awful. Ah, right, that's going to be a problem. Um, Thirty-five. Oh dear, uh, that's not a good look, is it really? But we can use that to our advantage. We can. Hmm. Um, right. Okay. So you are now going to be a one-way chap. There. Oh, there's a grain train coming now, isn't there? Uh, yeah. You can do that. And then, yeah. Oh, saucy. Right. We need to get rid of this road. We'll pop you back in. Don't panic. Don't panic. But this sorry excuse for a junction can be uh, an excuse for a junction. There we go. And now, all of a sudden, you're thinking, actually, that still doesn't look great. Hmm. I quite like it though. That's staying. That's staying. I, I feel like if British Rail had done it, that would be how they do it. You know. So I, I, I feel that that needs to stay. Right. We'll, we'll fifty you over there. Now we'll bring the. There we go. We'll, we'll, we'll pop the road back across. We want the road to come back across, don't we? And oh no, it's done that. There we go. Right. Come to there. And then there. And then up to there. Now doesn't that look nice? That looks very nice. Albeit it looks like there's been a landslide and the tunnel's covered over, but uh mm. right, fifty. Keep going at fifty. Plod in along. What about flat? Because then we'll get a nice bridge. But then will you be able to get down to the to the coast. Yes, you will. We'll bridge over the trees. Oh, look at that. That looks sensational. We'll get rid of the wooden bridge. Oh, no. Why has the menu changed? Why has that happened? Ooh, I like the menu change. Sorry. I thought that it was going to... Oh, look at that. Green. Silver. Red. Green. Silver. Different type of bridge. Ooh. Oh, this menu change is excellent. Sorry, I, I doubted you for a second there, Sire, but you are... You are that colour. That's the colour. I think that, that just... The green blends in too much. We want that bridge to stand out. That's a pretty bridge, isn't it? Right. Cross you go. Lovely. Oh, very nice indeed. Look at that. that that's nice. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Why am I getting so excited over a bridge? It's just a bridge. Yeah, but I think I think everybody loves a bit of a bridge in Transport Fever, don't they? You know, they, especially now that we've got the you know such a variety in colours, styles, designs. It's like Claire's accessories with bridges. Right, we'll bring you round. I don't think if we go straight across, we're going to get the the angle of attack we need to get down to the. Yeah, of course we are. What are you whinging about? That's that's fine. Oh. I don't know why I'm excited about this. I, I don't really play with the whole fuel side of things. Playing with fuel is bad. Oh, hang on. No, I don't want you there. Right, yeah. Uh, you, you shouldn't really play with fuel. Um, you know, explosions and all that. But yeah, uh, I very rarely actually use fuel on these games, so it's uh, it's it's good. I'm, I'm glad that we're... It's another one. I think it all stems from Open TTD. We'll put you there, so it's like you protect the crossing, isn't it? There we go. Ah, oh, look at that. Uh, I think it stems from Open TTD because the oil wells always close down on you, left, right, and centre. So I never use them. And then in Transport Fever, I never use them either because I think, oh, it might shut down. The industries don't shut down on this game. 
quite cool if new ones started up and you know they shut down if you didn't didn't see to them. I think that'd be quite cool. There's a lot of things in uh, in Transport Fever that would be great, uh, or a lot of things in Open TTD that would be great in Transport Fever. Really would be great. Right. So to business. Um, now, how can I cheap scare on the depot? Because that that seems to be a thing we're doing here. Uh, I can't. Uh, have we got one at Piddlemouth? No, we haven't. Right, let's... Um, sorry, I'm just whizzing around the map frantically now because I really don't want to have to put another depot in. That! Nope. <sighs> right, okay. I don't want a depot. There's too many depots. Ugh. Right. Um, let's stick one here. I feel that that is the prime place. I feel like I don't know where the depot is now. There we go. There's the depot. But you, you are something else. Uh, right. Come on. Fit nicely in next to the track. Because then the road looks good next to you. Got like some sort of an old oak common style thing going on. There we go. We'll, uh, yeah, keep it. We'll, we'll branch you over there. And then we'll branch you across there. Ah, what's that? Oh, it's an oil rig. Oh, that's funky. That's very funky. Right. Hold on. Well, uh, I don't really know what I'm doing. I'm, I'm just kind of playing about with it for the sake of playing about with it now. Just to make it look a bit weird. There we go. We'll bring you after the junction. And then we'll build you across there as well. The condition of train one is very poor. Oh no! There we go. Right, that signal can go. Because I think that signal's all we need. Right, the condition of train one. Hold on, we're, we're getting distracted here. Because train one is, of course, our trusty. Our trusty Piddlemouth branch. There we go. In VR green. Wow. Um, you can only carry 42. Let's get you replaced. Let's pause the game. Because uh, otherwise he's going to pick all those chaps up, isn't he? Uh, now, let's have a look at diesel multiple units. What have you got to offer as well? We've got the British Rail Class 150 stroke 2 in cross-country livery. I think not, you know. Um, right, Northern by Reaver. Bit early for that. Northern Rail, bit early for that. It's uh, regional rail grey front. <laughs> no. Um, where's where's regional railways? Have we have we got regional railways? Well, that's not Sprinter. That's Strathclyde. Nope. You've lost my interest there. Um, right. BR class one hundred and fifty stroke one provincial. How many can you carry? Sixty two. Okay. And we shall slap on the back. None of you, because you're post-privatisation. Uh, 156. Has privatisation happened yet? No, it's 1998. Provincial Sprinter. Ah! Nope. You're not what I wanted. You've clicked the wrong button there, you banana. Provincial Sprinter. Go! Make it so. This is where game crashes, isn't it? I, I have very little faith when it comes to adding trains on this game. Um, purely because it's been that long since I've played it, I can't remember what mods work and what don't. Ah, we appear to have had a problem. Uh, yes, there appears to be an issue at, <laughs> yeah, the, the driver, it's, oh, it's Kirby all over again. Uh, the driver appears to have, where are the, where are the wheels? There's, oh dear, there is a problem there. Although it can fit 102 passengers on, so you know, that's good. Oh, there's, oh, that's gone horribly wrong.
It's, uh, yeah. Oh dear me. Do we need to turn you round? No, but the auto saves happen now. Oh, what a disaster. Oh, it's found its wheels. That's good. Do we, do we actually need this much train? We don't need this much train. I'm sorry, um, but we need to just replace you with the 150. I, I'm realising that that was on the platform. Uh, straight one. We'll, we'll just keep the... I know, keep the regional railway sprinter. That'll do. Look, there's only 25 on. Oh, that's nice, isn't it? Yeah, we only need a 150, don't we? Because, I mean, when you think about it, I was looking at all those people on the platform, but, you know... North Kiltown, Piddlemouth Branch. Uh, oh no, the Little Astroth. Hang on, why did you only load with half of the people? Oh, it turns out we do need more. Oh, for Christ's sake. Right, okay. Right. Um, 150 stroke, one. Yeah, this is a lot... Is anybody else thinking, you know, this is a lot more difficult than it needs to be? Right, Um that was how they've gone sprint network northwest. There we go. We'll stick two together. But we don't want it to just be, you know, two 150s together. We we want a 156 on the back, don't we? There we go. Look at that. Ooh, splendid, the pair of them. They make a nice pair, don't they? And they can fit 102 passengers on, so that's you know, that's a marked improvement on what they could do before. Right, we have got distracted. We need to go back to wherever... Where did we build that depot now? There we go. North Killtown Depot 2. Uh, what freight locos can we have? Locomotives, diesel... What have we got at our disposal? I mean, we've got the 56. The 56 is very trustworthy. But let's use a 58. We've not got a 58 yet, and I feel that that's what we need. Uh, now, we've got some tankers somewhere. Yeah, first, British Rail, tanker, British Rail, British Rail. We ideally... There we go, British Rail. You can only carry cement. You're not a tanker. Oh, I've been, I've been going past you several times thinking, oh, look, there's that tanker. We'll use that at some stage. And it's not a tanker. It's for carrying bricks. Bricks don't fit in a round container. Yeah, maybe, maybe it's for cement. Double bogies. I don't want to use the... Oh, hang on, this might be... Oh, that's what we're using. Right, okay. Well, it's going to have to be... Um, who have we got? Unbranded VTG. Shell. Let's have BP. Uh, yeah, okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. That'll do. That's a nice mix, isn't it? And I've just realised that I've not actually put the uh, put the line on. Okay, so we are going to go. You're going to go up here? Hmm, yes you are. You're going to fully load? Yep. No maximum stop time, fully load. And you are going to come down to here. And you're going to make us some money. Hmm, nice. So you can be the puddle bridge. Oh, helps if you don't have the old caps lock on. Fuel train one. I have a feeling there's going to be more. Um, you know, I just just get that feeling in the old loins, you know. Uh, right. I can't see them. Too far away. Puddle Bridge fuel train. There we go. Let's have a look at the... Uh, the I mean, I've always thought and this might, you know, this might trigger some, uh, trigger some upset. I've always thought these are hideously ugly. I've never liked them. Why are you using it on your uh, transport fever map, then, if you don't like it? And the, the reason is... Oh, hang on. Oh, no, what's happening there? Stop. Let that train go first. You know, he's, he's going about important business. And I mean, to be fair, we're going to be going about important business as well, aren't we? But, uh, you know, his business is important to her. Hang 
Let's have some position lights. Ooh, they look pretty, don't they? Oh, that sounds nice. Here we go. We'll, we'll have a few more position lights. Oh no, you should be a signal. Ah, look at all the tankers. Let's, uh, let's get the old fast forward on. Wait. Oh, you're only half loaded. Why are you not fully loaded? Curse you. Uh, right. Yes. Off we go. I mean, it's, it's a bit American, isn't it? How it's, you know, it's got the, the whole sort of a sort of deal going on where you can walk down the side. It's like the Class uh, the class 70. That's very similar. Uh, is it built by General Electric or General Motors? Not General Motors. General Electric, I think. Yeah. I don't know if this was, but... Uh, yeah, I just always thought at the front it just looks very ugly, you know. It doesn't look as nice as a 66, for instance, does it? That that really does. Ah, hello, little class 20, where we started our video. I mean, this guy's just powering along, look, at 50 miles an hour. He's loving it. He's absolutely loving it, isn't he? Oh, it does look good, doesn't it? Rail freight, whatever happened to them? Hmm. Sore subject, I believe. Um, yeah. Oh no, sorry, it's not uh, rail freight. No, that's not a sore subject, is it? It's rail track that's the sore subject. Oop, more grain. More half full grain trains, or half empty, depending on, uh, depending on your outlook on life there. So we go to the left here, don't we? Yes, because otherwise we're going to hit a dead end. We're going to have a repeat of uh, a repeat of North Killtown over again through the buffers. Oh ho No, none of that. At least we managed to solve the problem, didn't we? Straight on. And there we go, that's, uh, you know, that's that's what we like, isn't it? A bit of slow expansion, you know, this was single track, it's now double track. It, you know, there's a lot of a lot of scope for, uh, you know, you can always expand, can't you? And I, I quite like that, how, you know, with instead of just banging it all in at once, this is, uh, I mean, can, can you undo 50 up here? Yeah, you can, can't you? It's not the end of the world, it keeps things a little bit slower. Because then you get more trains on when everything's running a bit slower. I mean, I wouldn't have thought you'd make it up the hill with a full load anyway, would you really? Well, you'll have to, because, uh, you know, the, you have to come up this hill. I mean, this this is the money shot at the top, isn't it, really? Not not this bit. We could actually, while we're here, just, just take a bit of a hacksaw to the old landscape. Bit of the bit of smoothing. Just, just get rid of those sharp edges, there we go. Particularly around there as well. That's going to look nice, isn't it? Just that bit there. Oh, brilliant. I like how it's so long as well that it's in this tunnel and that tunnel at the same time. Brilliant. Now, this bit here from the road. Let's, uh, let's... Ooh. I need the camera, the, the camera tools on. I switched them off. Can't remember why. Um, beautiful. Oh, there's a tree in the way. And now there's a hill in the way. Never mind, um, we tried our best with that one. Is there actually things waiting? Oh, wow! There's, uh, yeah, there is actually things waiting. Jolly good. Are we, are we going to, like, see how much you make? I don't know quite what's going to happen with the industry at the other end, you know, because um, with them being so close to each other, does one talk to another? I don't know if one talks to another.
that blithering autosave. Well, if it does crash, we won't have long to, uh, you know, long to backtrack, will we? Because it's always flipping autosaving. Well, hey, on the move. It's a fine balancing act for it on this game, isn't it? Because it, it all... The amount produced here depends on the demand at the other end, and you know it's really, really difficult to get it right with freight. That's why I tend to stick to passenger on uh, on freight, on, uh, on transport fever too. Uh, so freight for me, this is kind of a this is a big deal. Normally, I just run passenger services. There we go. Look at that. Ooh, what have we got? Uh, we've got some buses. We've got a Merlin. Oh, a class 47. Oh, and some, some proper lorries now. That's good. British Airways World Cargo. Oh, there's a there's a lot of... Oh, hang on. You, yeah, the list disappeared. There's uh, Yeah, there's a lot now. We need some proper lorries, don't we? I mean, how are our vehicles actually holding up? I, uh, I, just, I just want all of them. Can we... Yeah, all. Uh, condition... Very good. Very bad. Oh no, the the 37s. Oh, that's a shame. The uh, the North Killtown grain, grain delivery. That's uh, hmm. let's see. Can we replace you with something a bit better? Are you are you 37s or are you? I don't know what you are. You are 37s, aren't you? We'll we'll do that next time. We'll do that next time. I'm I'm just focused on this right now. That bridge is pretty. I can't get over. Uh, the fact that this is only ever going to be used for tanker trains. I feel the bridge is a bit over-engineered for tanker trains. You know, we'd, I'd love to have quite a bit running over this section of track. Can you, like, found a new town down here so we can have a passenger service running from Piddlemouth? I don't think we can. And I don't imagine a, a coastal Avonpool kind of railway shindig would be very popular, purely because of how long it takes. I think they'd rather go up and over, wouldn't they? I mean, that's a nice route as well. There's a lot of nice routes on this map, aren't there? The, the landscape is really geared up for nice routes. Nah. Look at that, snaking through the tunnel. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. Flying along. Other. Let's just get you past the. Uh, I mean, we could also. Piddlemouth needs to expand out this way. I mean, Piddlemouth's getting huge. We need to shove some buses in there, really, don't we? I keep saying this. I'm like, oh yeah, we'll do that at some point. We'll we'll bus. We'll put some buses in Piddlemouth. The problem with putting buses in Piddlemouth is that uh, you know the the trains are struggling to cope as it is for demand. I don't know quite what's going to happen if. Uh, I mean, what, what does Piddlemouth want? Piddlemouth wants fuel as well. Ooh, I hadn't realised that. That's good. It's very good. I don't know if we're going to get trains to, you know, to take to these places, though, to be honest with you. I mean, there'd be little 20s with, you know, with, with machines. Well, there wouldn't be 20s with machines, would there? There'd be, uh, yeah, you know what I mean. Oh, it's getting... This is this is the high-speed section of the route, isn't it? I mean, how fast can you go? Uh, emission... Top speed, 80. I don't think we're going to get to 80 down this section of track. And uh, the reason I don't think that is because we can only do 60. Because it's a branch line. But we might get to 60. That's the fastest this train's gone on its journey so far. Look at that, flying round. And then at least if this train is, you know, if the, if the machine's train or the tool's train comes alongside, it won't interrupt it. So I think that's that's a nice little bit of track there. I don't think it'll see that much use, because again, the traffic down here is not that much, to be honest with you, is it? I reckon we need, like, a vehicle loading and unloading. 
just in a little, uh, just at a little stop. I feel like that's something I've seen before. You tell it to go there and load, and then there and unload, and it'll just sit there loading and unloading to get things from one side to the other. Oh, what's that? Are you, you're a taxi, aren't you? You're a, yeah, you're in a taxi. If you'd have taken the train, love it, it'd have been much cheaper. Although I feel I've got, yeah, I've got buses taken to industrial buildings, haven't I? So, uh, oh no, I've not got buses. I've got demand for passengers at industrial buildings. So yeah, there, there is no train. Unless you fancy hopping on the back of a tanker wagon, which uh, I can't see you'd want that as you commute to work, really, would you? Well, there we have it. I think that's where we're going to end today. Thank you so much for watching. If you have enjoyed today's video, click that like button because it helps the video get more views. Join us in the Discord. Uh, there is a Discord link. Hang on. How much have we made? Twelve and a half million nearly. Wow. I mean, we, we're very much. We can pay the whole loan back now. Uh, yeah, join us in the Discord. I don't, I don't tend to promote that as much as I, I should, really. There's a link in the Discord. And uh, there's a link in the Discord. There's a link in the description. And if you click that, you can join our little Discord server. Um, and we we have a chat. And you could suggest things that you think, well, that might be a good idea. And I shall then steal your ideas and claim them as my own. Uh, but yeah, join us in the Discord if if you you know if that takes your fancy. And uh, come and have a natter with us. And of course, if you haven't already, click that subscription button or the subscribe button. Don't cost you anything to do, and you'll get told when all these funky cool videos come out. You know, just just do it. I mean, if you've made it this far and you haven't subscribed already, what's wrong with you? Get that button pressed. Uh, yeah, th this is turning into a bit of a rant now. So I shall see you next time. Cheerio. Goodbye for now.